Hey everyone, what is up? It is your girl Melanie here. If you have one second, please hit the subscribe down right below if you want to see more of my videos and don't forget to turn on the bell. This is episode two of Cook with Mel's. <laughs> Finally, we have better lighting-ish. I have a better position finally to film, thankfully. And so today I decided that I'm going to be making homemade Starbucks holiday coffee for you guys. It's just very simple and an easy way of how to make hot coffee at home. I did a fall video of this that I was supposed to upload on my channel around this time last year, but I ended up uploading it this year in my 10 videos that I never uploaded, so go check that out. This is a newer one of 2020. Let's get into it, I'm excited. I'm a lot more prepared this time, I haven't started. I feel like I'm already right on track. All right, so obviously there's water in there. Uh, this thingy. <laughs> um, I have to put this in there, but I'm waiting for a second. So yeah, head start, I got these thingies, paper thingies. <laughs> I'm so bad at this, I gotta try again, okay. First off, so I have my water in there. I'm gonna put a paper thingy in here with coffee, but just in a little bit. I need to put this back. Okay, next we are gonna try Christmas blend. And then we're also gonna try holiday blend. But I like my coffee sweet, but we're also gonna try it black like the way it is. And these are the creamers. I have peppermint mocha for the holidays and funfetti vanilla, which I love. I have these little paper thingies for the coffee, little scoop and then coffee cups. So let's get started. Basically the whole point of this video is I'm gonna try it black how it is and then another version of it black with cream. So yeah, I, I'll just get started so y'all know what I mean. Okay, so first we're gonna put this in. Okay. We will start with the Christmas blend. Okay, the smell is all right. We'll just see how this will taste. Basically, you just get like a scoop, honestly. Mm -hmm. I don't want to spill it. Sure, we'll just do maybe another. Again, I'm not really good with this stuff. When I do it and get in the rhythm of it, I'm good with making coffee, but it takes a bit. So. Yeah, we'll just leave it there for now. I don't know why I put this in here when I need it. Okay, now we're gonna close it. Turn it on. How does making coffee work? I know. Let's try this. See, the coffee thing doesn't make sense. Oh, okay, it's doing its thing now. I just was pressing buttons. <laughs> Don't be like me and be unprepared. But actually, to be honest, I am more prepared this time than in episode one because I got everything out. So, improvement. <laughs> okay, it's making, yay. Um, yeah, <laughs> I don't know what else to do. But do you hear it, guys? It's making. Maybe I put too much, but it's okay. We are learning. All right, back to my cute little setup. This is goals. Actually, to be honest, guys, I really want to have my own like clothes and cafe shop someday. Maybe I'd call it Mel's, I don't know. <laughs> Mel's cafe and clothes shop. <laughs> Something to do with that, there we go. But yeah, this is like a sneak peek of it someday. Not really, I don't know. <laughs> we'll see, I could dream on about it. All right guys, wrapping up, it's about to get done. I realize I have too much water in it. I forgot to drain some of it out. It's kind of because my family already had the coffee ready, but I promise I'm going to get it ready for them again. But, oh my gosh. I don't know what I'm going to do with it all. Like, for real, what was I thinking? Okay, it's done. Oh, I spoke too soon. Are you really done? Oh, it looks done. It's just making weird sound. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm scared. I don't want to do anything wrong. Come on. Are you going to come out of here? Yes. Okay. Good coffee. Okay. So we're also going to let it cool down as well. It's way too hot to drink. Right? 
or at least some room for creamer in both. That's why. Okay. There we go. This is our Christmas blend. Okay. There we go. We will start with this one because I want to try this one. I love vanilla. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be real. I'm nervous about these coffees. They are like different. So we'll have to see. Let's try the creamer. Let's hope it cools down a little bit. Hmm. It's pretty good. This is the Christmas blend with the vanilla cake creamer. Now this is just black coffee. I don't like straight up black coffee. I don't really get why people like it because I don't like it. <laughs> but tell me in the comments below if you like black coffee or coffee with creamer. I want to know a little bit more and just like why. Is it a taste thing? Is it just like because kind of thing? Everyone's different. I like my coffee with creamer and sugar, but Actually, I can sometimes do just creamer because that's like enough for me. I don't want to have like too much sweet, but yeah, like tell me because I want to know because I'm not really much of a black coffee person. So let's give it a try and see. This is now just black coffee of the Christmas blend. We're going to add the peppermint mocha creamer. Mm -hmm. Did you think I was going to just drink it like that? No, that was disgusting. I'm not much of a peppermint mocha. Well, I like peppermint. Okay, rephrase. I'm not much of a mocha person. Peppermint's good. Y'all know at Starbucks I don't really like mocha, but this is a coffee mate, so it's different. So we'll see if it's good. Mm, smells like candy cane, peppermint tea. Hmm. Okay, at first, Loki, I didn't think I was gonna like it, but it's actually not bad. <laughs> you don't taste much of the mocha. This actually reminds me of just like a candy cane, like a peppermint candy cane. There we go. That's why I'm trying to go with this. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna get ready for the next coffee now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I don't know why I'm being weird. It's late at night and I'm filming a cooking with Mel's video. I love how they're just always late at night. Well, everyone's asleep, so it's like my time to be in the kitchen. <laughs> Y'all want to know what I just realized? I'm going to be wired on coffee. <laughs> what the heck? Honestly, this coffee machine is like freaking me out. It's like loud a little and there's like smoke. So I really hope I don't mess anything up. But we have one more coffee to make. And then obviously off camera because I'll be done filming. I'm going to get the coffee ready for my family for the next day. So next we're going to try the holiday blend. Yay. I'm gonna put this in. We'll do, I don't know. I wanna do like enough coffee, but then I don't wanna do like too much, you know? So I guess that's good. Ah, I didn't put it in this time. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see if it's gonna work. Work, 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 work. Let's see. Okay. <laughs> I'm nervous. I'm gonna try it with the peppermint mocha first this time because I tried it with the vanilla cake first the last time. So heads up on that. I feel like on Christmas morning, like when you're waiting for your presents, but instead I'm waiting for the coffee to be made. <laughs> I'm so weird, I know. See, it's getting made. The holiday blend, yay. All right, the coffee's done. Luckily there wasn't a lot of water this time.
first we're gonna try this. It is the holiday blend with the peppermint mocha creamer. Hmm. They taste definitely really different. I think so far I like the Christmas blend better, but it's hard to explain the taste. So the holiday blend has like a herbal and sweet maple notes is what it says. Makes sense, that's kind of what it tastes like. And then the Christmas blend is spicy and refined. See, I thought I would like holiday better than Christmas, but I think I like the Christmas one better. Let's try the holiday blend black now. Nope. I think the Christmas blend black is better, but I don't like either black. So now we're gonna add the vanilla. Let's see what this will taste like, because I do like this flavor a lot. Okay, so this one is the holiday blend with the vanilla cake creamer. I actually like this one a lot. Honestly, I feel like Christmas blend wins. <laughs> And that is all for this video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Something a little different on the channel. Well, the series is different, but I don't know how often I'm gonna post of Cook with Mel's because I have so many other uploads right now, but I'm hoping in 2021 to give Cook with Mel's more of a chance because I do wanna learn how to cook, like for real. And since quarantine at this point is like forever, I gotta learn some hobbies at home. So We'll see what happens. I definitely want to carry on with this series. It just might have to be more into next year, but maybe this year too. We'll see. I just didn't know how soon I was going to do episode two because I'm so busy with so many things on my channel right now. So yeah, I don't know. We'll just see. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, give it a thumbs up, please, because I made a lot of coffee and I'm wired on coffee now. And my family's going to wake up soon. I got to clean this up. Oh my goodness. Bye, Mel's Nation. I love you all so much. And stay safe.